so all right guys so here i am again with the second part uh where we left uh, the part one so in this uh, video tutorial in episode two we are going to discuss about uh, compositing and how i add this kind of effects to make this logo more beautiful so guys uh, here it is uh, now we are uh, jump into the after effects and you as you can see now i'm using after effects and the version is uh, 2017 and uh, let's uh, discuss about uh, this logo animation okay guys so let's get started so guys first of all let me share part one okay guys so here it is part one oh, sorry a short number one okay guys so let me show you first this is my diffuse render okay see this okay nothing else and guys uh, you guys were asking about lightning and uh, rendering settings so inshallah i'm going to discuss in other parts so just right now you guys can focus on this compositing setup what i'm going to teach you in this video hope you guys will learn a lot from this video and uh, keep sharing this video and keep sharing the channel and just appreciate me how i am working for you day and night to make the tutorial more beautiful and even i'm just trying to speak english <laughs> it's very complicated for me so guys uh, let's continue the tutorial and now here it is just render okay as you can see this is uh, the after effects okay and a lot of people were asking did you use any hue in this uh, uh, logo colors or some colors so I just again and again answer them nothing else just simple because when I received this project from my client so he just uh, asked me that and he what he said hey Faisal I have a project and you have only one day so wallahi I was just surprised and I say okay do you have any reference so he just say no so then i just ask him so is there any requirement from you or from your client so he just directly say faisal we believe in you and we really love your work and the style of your work so just i'm going to share the artwork of logo and just do it by yourself and they say uh I know you are going to give us 150% within one day so what I just come up with you guys can see this animation oh, this animation okay so this project is just completed in just 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 one day in just 23 hours okay guys so let me share okay this just a render and about the render setting i'm just uh sorry i'm just going to share in some other parts okay so right now just focusing on composite because this series of tutorial you guys will learn a lot okay guys so here it is simple i just rendered it out and just import the file and you can see okay guys and see this here is uh, ambient occlusion so you guys can see the depth okay and the target let's leave it and the main thing is particles see guys how these particles work on this comp in composition and let's see this is strokes okay guys so strokes is simple i just create a spline okay and just animate it if I create a new comb just for you guys and write it down stroke for you guys so 
okay i'm going to create a solid and write it down as strokes and create some random splines okay then just go to effects and preset and here you guys can write it down is strokes okay and now 3d stroke okay so guys you can see uh, here it is and uh, now we are going to animate it see guys simple and now you can offset this animation and hide it and now you can see this animation how words work looks very nice and it depends on you if you go to tapper in 3d stroke session section sorry enable it and see this it depends on you open it or just and thickness like this now if you offset this animation so looks like this nice and it's depend on you just manually you can give any color red yellow orange any any color okay guys and just back to a short one so i work like this and now come to shot number two oh, the main you can see the entire shot okay so simple nothing else i'm just going to solo it you just focus here i'm not using any 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 effects and presets in this layer just directly imported from c4d and just put it on the timeline and just and just add some effect that's it nothing more okay guys so again i'm going to solo the particles layer and uh, another let's see this okay okay guys and here is some strokes as i showed you uh here how you guys can make strokes like this and animate okay guys so simple nothing and, and guys if you want to learn the particles so recently i have upload upload the uh video tutorial and in this uh, recent project i just talk about particles in detail so you guys can see the link in the description and you guys can follow the link and you guys will learn particles as well so okay then jump to shot number three here you can see same okay i just switch to fit okay and see this same particles and i just you know how these particles are tracking because I used Cinema 4D helping layer where you guys can import the camera and layer and you guys just you know where to put the particles it gives you some references okay so inshallah in next part I'm going to teach you about this also so in shot number four aha so the main shot see this uh, you know simply any i what i use in this i use see you know <laughs> if you go in depth in this short number 4 in short number 4 composition so so, so you see the uh, terrible things <laughs> going here okay see this you know even when i export and just deliver to my client even he don't know what to do and i even i don't know 
and but alhamdulillah the client liked it a lot and he just appreciated and said fast so splendid and even my client said fast so splendid so here i come up with so guys uh, what i have done here simply now i'm going to show you simple see this uh, if i on the windows just i use you or like this you see the opacity okay and nothing you see ease in ease out nothing nothing guys nothing just simple and see this and what i do is this i just uh, use illustrator logo file see this and i just simply even i'm and even i don't you need track this logo i just use sanma 4d okay i just bring it the camera and helping layer like this and i just uh import here the solid and the target and i just replace the logo to this helping layer like this and you can see the result how this tracking working very well so guys the here it is the simple work i have done for this project so guys i hope you guys uh, learn a lot in this project and you know guys let me clear you first in this composite series why i share in the, if i'm talking about myself so this project is uh, i think nothing for me okay because i don't i don't use any any third party plugins and etc and some hood graphics nothing nothing but this is just a basic why i'm sharing this project with you guys because too many uh, subscribers and followers just asking just faisal just try to upload the basic project basic basic so here it is what i can do for you guys so here it is a basic project and nothing just import this from sanma 4d and just in, oh, just put it down here in timeline and how i use it i just share with you guys so guys uh, i hope you uh, understand this uh, video tutorial and simple video tutorial as uh, what i can say and uh, i hope you guys can make something like this and share with me and if you guys are fam familiar with me so you guys can join my whatsapp group where you can share your work and you can ask anything related to design animation and upcoming video tutorial and my projects what i am going right now currently so even you guys can share your uh, work okay so thanks for watching bye bye